What's up? What's up? What's going on, guys? Let's talk to more Slate Monday, March 24, 2021. But before we do, let's talk about tonight's Slate. And it's looking bad. I mean, like, I had, Z I had like, what? Two teams with Luca. I had zero Joe Harris. I had no Brown at all. The other news turned things around. I had to get half of my team with Luca because I have the salary. I get me some Joe Harris. I get me some Brown. Man, and TLC, which I didn't have. Now I end up with all those guys. Change everything is around. I should have prepared without those guys playing. And I still don't have that many look. I should have do that. But definitely one of my worst slates so far. It's looking at. And I don't think that's going to change because it's a bit down. All right. So as you can see, it's 6190. 39. Well, at least. It, I think it was 40 points. Now it's only 29. So a little bit better. And Trey Young. I'm actually very disappointed on Trey Young. But right now, that's the only team that's cashing, and I don't think any other team going to get in the money. Yep, it's looking bad. Definitely bad now. FGK is a little bit better. Uh, Jared Allen actually did okay. I had Posengis, fine. Man, it's, let's look at the winning lineup real quick. All entry, and I play a lot of teams too. Let's look at the winning lineup. They have uh, Garland. I have Garland. I just had to, I should have had more Garland. But hey, John Wall right now in the winning lineup, even if only 34.9. Levert, ooh, I was thinking about getting Levert. I still didn't get there. Monk was in there. Larry Nance, that's some, somebody I like. I have Nance, Monk on the same team on ZK. Uh, Siakam, I have them on here. I also have Siakam here too. So basically, if you could have Siakam and Pozengis, then you could have a good night. Shakam, Pozengis, Allen, if you have those guys and Nance. Anyway, guys, and let's check. Actually, let's check ZK real quick. Let's check ZK. ZK. Oh, sorry. That's the wrong place. At least in ZK, I'm looking a little bit better. So this is a, a sad. I'm winning 25. And that's the same team. Man, I don't know. Look at this team. How bad that team is. All I had to do is put that team in here and I would have a chance to win that $300 voucher. Man, it's only like, anyway, I'm very disappointed on this right here. But that team is uh, the team I made last night, guys, with those players that I gave you guys. Yes. All the players I gave you guys is on that team. Let's open it and let's check. That team I had John Wall, 36. Ali Burton, 27.75. Bogdanovich. 25.75, Lori Markin 28 and 18.33. 30, so those guys are in there. Definitely, uh, if you go with my five players, you definitely looking good. At least much decent than most of the team I'm seeing here. I'm in 49th place right now. So this thing, I still have two guys in there, which is Ali Burton and Bogdanovich. Because the other game is not closed, that actually going to help me a lot. So definitely looking better on ZK, and I should do much better than I'm doing. Uh, let's see. I'm hoping, let's see those guys right here. Uh, they have, okay, Ali Burton too. And they have <laughs> the same player I have, so there is nothing I can do about that. All right. So, oh, man, this is ugly slate. And they have uh, Mitchell, but it should be done. Okay, so let's talk about the slate. Okay, so point guard. Westbrook at 11.1k, the most expensive player in the slate against the Knicks. Uh, it's a five game slate, but I don't know if I want to put a Westbrook, but I don't think there's any defense for Westbrook, to be honest. He can still get you a triple double every night. He's playing so much better than he was playing early in the season because he was hurt or coming back from injury. So definitely back to being himself. Almost every night he's on the floor. He's a triple the ball threat. All right. So, uh, me personally, I'm not looking to play him based on how the diamond is going to fall for me. But we'll see. But as definitely not the guy I'm looking to give you guys. Lillard 9.4K against Miami. I don't mind Lillard. It's the first game. I don't mind him. 
Uh, Fox 8.9k is bowling right now, so definitely looking to play him again against Golden State. Ben Simmons, I do like Ben Simmons against the Lakers at 8.2k. Uh, I'm not going to say it's going to be a blowout, but Lakers right now is not looking good though. Shorter 7.2k against Ben Simmons. Oh, I don't know if I want to do that. I would rather go with Maury at 6.7k. Uh, if somehow the Lakers can keep this game closed, then Shorter could be one of the reasons, should be one of the reasons. Uh, Jordan Poole, 6.2k. Uh, is in play against the Kings. Uh, was 6k. If was ready to play, then I don't mind at 6k because it's only five game slate. Uh, but I like uh, Alfred Payton here at 5.2k. Uh, I know he hasn't really been playing much minute, but hopefully if was is out, he's been gonna crank up. So definitely like him here against the uh, one of the worst team when it's come for defensive uh, team. Uh, so I like Payton here. Who else I do like here? That basically, Alex Caruso at 3.6k would be another guy I like. 3.6k Alex Caruso. Alright, so now who am I going to go with? I know he hasn't, none actually, I do like none here against Portland 5.5k, especially if Dragic is out. Let's see if Dragic is uh, out or is it uh, probable. Let's check this out real quick. Right now he is questionable, so hopefully he's out. If he is... Then I like him. If he's not out at that price, definitely in play. Only 4.8k. Average about 25 fantasy game. Uh, Emmanuel quickly at 4.7k. He is definitely on a rookie slump right now. I think Shake Melton to me is in play. Uh, and Derek White. Whew. I don't know what to say about Derek White, man. I was expecting him to be much better, but he hasn't. But uh, again, it's a five game slate. He's gonna most likely, if it's not a blowout, gonna play over 30 minutes. So, yes, he's in play. But I'm gonna go with a guy that actually hasn't been really too good. And that will be the Dan Tremori. All right. Uh, I'm gonna go with him here at 6.7k. Uh, my other choice would be uh, Siemens or Fax. Uh, I would possibly go with Fax over Siemens here. I know I don't play for blowout, but I'm looking at the matchup. I think I would go with Fox here if I had to go between the two, but I do like them. They're, both of them are in my top five. Uh, so right now it's Maury and then those two, two and three, not in, in not any particular order. And then uh, Peyton, I do like. I would put him forward and I would go all the way to Alex Caruso five. Uh, I mean, I definitely can see Caruso make it. In the winning lineup that's fine we sound crazy but it could make it there so let's go with uh maury here um i think the, the top two gonna be the most popular play but i'm gonna go with more here at that price because he does have an upside of a triple double for shooting guard to me it's a little bit uh easy to for me to pick uh you have choices you have bought the bill at 9.2k i'm gonna pass on that i don't mind the models in 8.9k i don't mind paul josh 8.2k his last game was bad. I think it was a blowout. But I love CJ here at 7.5, even against Miami. Andrew against is in play for me. The same group for Body High, Body Hill. Uh, Ali Burton, price still the same 5.7K. So I like that. Uh, Hero 5.2K. THT is in play for me. I think his price went down from what it was last time. Seth Curry might be back, but I will stay away in this game. Um, oh man, that can what I've been saying. He's a shooter, so he's in play, but um, with, I don't think I'm playing him. They mean Lee would be another cheap guy if I want to take a chance. Actually, he has been seen minute lately at over 20 minutes. For that reason, I would play him. He played at least 20 minutes in the last three or four games, so he's definitely in play. And for a cheap play, it's a five game slate. You don't have to play him though. Lou Williams, DC has been really bad. I don't know if they're going to move him. Oh, by the way, Guys, drop a like in this video for me. Do it right now, all right? I would really appreciate it. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. And also turn on your bell notification. So as soon as I upload those videos, you guys can receive the notification. All right. Uh, tomorrow is the uh, last day for trade deadline. It's the trade deadline. So there's a chance. I think I don't. there's a chance some guys could get moved. 
But I don't know if any of those teams, there's any guy we should be looking at. Maybe uh, Portland might try to get a lot deeper or something like that. I don't understand why, but... And also Miami and the Knicks might try to get some players. I can also see the... Uh, was it the Kings or Golden State also could be everybody actually, even except possibly Philly. But I can see uh, everybody else make a trade here, except for Philly. And Washington, I don't think they're moving Bill. So, all right, so shooting guard, who the, oh yeah, Lou Williams. Man, Lou Williams, I just don't know, man. Right now I cannot play him. The help side is there. Maybe he need a change, but right now he's not looking good. Let's go up. I'm going to go up. I already give you guys the uh, on the 7K players. I want to go with uh, Andrew Wiggins. The matchup is great. But uh, Paul George, Mac I'm going to go with uh, McCollum here, man, at 7.5K. Uh, that's the guy I'm going to go here. I think he should be getting ready to be back to be McCollum at 7.5K. That's a great price. Uh, people might still, you know, don't want to play him based on how he's been playing. But the minutes are cranking up, so give me some McCollum. Small forward. Kawhi Leonard, 9.7K. Butler, 9.5K. As great as Butler has been, I think I would rather go Kawhi. I do like Kelly Oubre. I do like Butler, by the way. Uh, I like Kawhi, more, especially on ZK. I like him more because he's cheaper. I mean, yeah, he's cheaper than Butler. But here... I here I don't mind either one of them. They maybe if I need the 200, I'll go to Butler. If I don't, I might go with Kawhi. I think yeah, here I'll go with Butler. But over there, I'll go with Kawhi. Kelly Oubre 72k to me is the best play. Where him and Draymond Green could be the type of players that could give you triple double. So I do like him here. Kuzma 7k price up, but he, if Lakers going to have any chance. He's going to have to be a part of it. So for that reason, yes. But the price is so high. I think I'd rather go with a uh, Bonds here or RJ. Um, Kellen Johnson, he had the, that his moments where in like two games, he had a, what, 58 and then a 32. Then he went back to being Kellen Johnson. He's, and you know, Pop, when that happened, your minutes going away. He, Danny Green, if he is out... If he's out, then that's a guy is questionable right now. If he's out, then we're going to have some, you know, a cheap play in Thai Bull for uh, Philly we might want to go to. Oh, one guy I didn't talk about, let's go to shooting guard. His price should be 2.5K. If he didn't do much. Uh, between him and Damian Lee, let's see if it's 3.5. Yeah. Pork and cock might. I think I've got to play him over, over Damian Lee. Because most likely we know he's going to play more minutes. And he's a shooter, but he actually does other things too. Uh, okay, so small forward. Uh, how do I play? Ryu Achimura over Kelvin Johnson. Carmel Anthony, when he comes, he's going to look to shoot. He's going to look to do his thing. I think KCB, uh, I, oof, man, this is bad. Chubber Wiser, let's see his minutes. Okay, 23 minutes. He's definitely getting more minutes, but it's a no for me. I'd rather go with Derek Jones. It looks like Nicholas Bittum is getting less and less minutes. So, based on that, he's been still on the 20s. So, if you look at somebody at the price range, he would be my choice between him and Ty Bull, especially if Granny Green is out. As far as the guy, I'm going to go here. Man, when I was looking at my... When I did my team, let's see. Who, let, let me check my team real quick. All right. I just checked my team and I have Kelly Oubre and Bonds as my small forward. But here, uh, for right now, let's go to power forward. I will get back to you guys because I'm thinking of a uh, connection right now. But I have to, let's go to power forward and I will get back to the small forward. Julius Center 10.2K. Yes, I like him uh, against Washington. Tobias, 8.8K, I also like him. Uh, but right now, I'm going to tell you guys, the guy I'm going to give you guys is Ben <coughs> at 8K. Uh, like I said, I do like Tobias, I do like Julius Slender. But the 10.2K, 
bit a little bit steep but based on what he's been doing man this guy is hitting trees uh, getting you look at the assist man look at this i mean that's rebounds look 17 6 12 he actually been I, I I always like him, but I never thought he would be more like a triple threat. Okay, so some price went up. Tony, Tony Bradley played over 30 minutes, but had a great game against the Lakers. I can see that happen again. 5.4K. I do like Javon Green at 7K here. Hopefully that game can start. I believe that game could stay close. Could be the best game of this slate. Um, I like all the top guys here. Marvin Backley is out. Marcus Smoke is 5K. The price is going up, but he's getting the minutes. Uh, so I don't mind taking a chance on him. Uh, is he, did they, he didn't play. He was a DNP. Uh, let's see. He didn't leave the bench Tuesday. Yep. Man, after he came and had a great game. And that basically it for me. I'm not playing anybody else down there. Um, so definitely Rando, Tobias, Bam, Draymond, Alakovi. He didn't play much because he was a, but he still ended up with like 30 plus fantasy points. So that was great to see. Uh, 38.8, basically 39 on 24 minutes. And that's the guys I like. Basically the guys on top for center. I have some choices here. Uh, Holmes, 8K. I most likely am not going to go there. Kente 6.8k Montrez. I don't like any of those points to be honest. I don't. But you're gonna have to play somebody. And it looks like Mitchell Robinson is back playing his solid minutes, so I do like him. I also like Kente against Miami, Montrez. I think I would rather go home here because Montrez will have to go against our. That's not gonna be easy for him at all. Okay? And uh I do like Jacob Porto at 5.4K. It looks like his minute has been, where is phew, his minute is going down. I don't like that. I would rather go with Howard here at 5.4K. And um, if Kelly O getting the start, then I don't mind going there. I'm not really looking forward to play him, even though he had that big game. But uh, if he get the start, then that's something else. Uh, Looney, it's a no for me. It's not going to play much. And that's basically it. So basically it's uh, homes. The price is steep, but based on what you have available is in play. One choice is also in play, but I would rather go with Holmes or Kente or Mitchell Robinson. And based on who I had, most likely that's what I'm going to Let's see what I have here. Oh, never. It's crazy, guys. The guy I'm not looking to play, that's why I have on the team. I have Kevin Looney on my team. So that team, I'm definitely going to change it. I'm going to go with Howard against his old team. Uh, I do like Zubak, by the way. So Zubak, I do like him. He has been good. Even if he doesn't play 30 minutes, it's, it's going to get... Look at this. has been really, really good since he's been starting. And his minutes is a little bit fluctuate, like 34, 35, then 24, 24. If even if he can get you just 34, 24 minutes, there's a chance he will get you 30 fantasy points. And if Ibaka is out, then definitely is in play. Uh, let's see what they said about Ibaka. Most likely he's out. And then let's go to the small forward position. You have 6.4k left. You can basically play anybody you want here. Again, I do like Bonds here against Golden State, against his old team. So that's one of the reasons I had him. But I'm going all the way to Jimmy Butler here at 9.5K. Now you're going to have to find some cheap guys to go there. Or you can change that if you want to a Bonds or RJ or Kelly Oubre. Because I like Kelly Oubre. Or even Kuzma. Bonds, if you put Bonds, then you have 6.K left. So that's much better. But I'm going to stay here with Jimmy Butler. All right. Let's go to DK and check those guys out. For DK, Peyton, 5.1K. CJ McCallum, 7.2K. Kawhi Leonard, 8.8K. Oubre, 6.2K. And Robinson, 5.1K. Definitely like Oubre Price and, Ma and Robinson Price better here. Let's check some other players. And uh, I, do like, I do like Bam here at 
at 8k Paul George 7.8k I do like those guys Kente 6.6k I don't mind Bond 6.3k Zubak 5.6k I would 5.5k all those guys I also like them I don't mind Milton um, you know what let's go back to web I didn't really talk about uh, let's let's check wise man here how much is wise man wise man is 4.2k I mean minutes he played last game he played 25 so actually that's pretty good if you're gonna play about 25 minutes again then he is and play for me all right guys that's basically it for FDNDK let's see uh, my team is not now it's 23 all right uh, come on man I need more minutes out of uh, where's this guy where's my team that that's not my team where's my team really want come on I need a little bit more here all right guys that's basically it yeah I need more from uh oh man if that game go to it OT that definitely gonna help me out here okay that's basically it please subscribe turn on your bell notification and I'm out